Without Atari, there wouldn't be a Chuck E. Cheese. Before we get into pizza served by a rat with entertainment as his middle name, Atari was founded with $500 by Nolan Bushnell in 1972, creating coin-operated arcade games. Atari's first big hit was Pong. Simple, addictive, and two-player. Quickly becoming a cultural phenomenon, people lined up outside of bars and arcades to play Pong. Combining the newly released microprocessor and cartridge-based games, Atari would pivot into the home gaming console market with the release of the Atari 2600. Its library of games supported by a third-party developer ecosystem set the standard for future consoles. In 76, Nolan Bushnell sold Atari for $28 million, which gave him funding to start his new side project. Chuck E. Cheese. Wanting to differentiate from the arcades Nolan was selling to at Atari, Chuck E. Cheese would combine pizza, games, and animatronic animals into a family-friendly restaurant. The animatronic band entertained families, while pizza added wait times which let kids have more time to play games. And that's why 